love is in the air, everywhere we look around. Who's your favorite Disney couple? We're about to show you real-life versions of Jasmine and Aladdin, Tarzan and Jane, and eight other iconic Disney couples. Wait until you see if your favorite made the list. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and give this video a big thumbs up. Today we're checking out 10 Disney couples in real life. Ariel and Eric. Let's start with the two that instantly fell in love, but only one of them had a pair of feet. Ariel first saw Eric on his ship. He was playing with Max the dog, who actually noticed the mermaid taking a peek at the ship life. You could clearly see Ariel falling for the guy, who was also the first human she ever saw up close. After the storm rocked the ship, Ariel saved Eric, and that was the start of the enchanting love story. They're definitely a cute couple, but check out this real life couple. They decided to recreate a few scenes dressed as Ariel and Eric, and they did an amazing job. You can find their amazing cosplays at their DeviantArt account called Mayumi Loves Sora. The two really are relationship goals. The woman's name is Mayumi, and she's rocking Ariel's long red hair, while Sora is giving us those charming Eric vibes. The two also cosplay as several other Disney characters, but we think this look is the absolute best. In The Little Mermaid, Ariel longs to be with humans. But did you know her iconic Part of Your World song was almost cut from the movie? The directors screened an early version of The Little Mermaid to an audience full of kids, and they noticed the kids got bored at that part. Luckily, they screened the movie again in color, and Part of Your World was a keeper. Rapunzel and Flynn Rider these two are definitely one of the most interesting Disney couples out there with quite an unusual story. We can imagine Flynn explaining how the two met. He would explain that he was running from a crazy horse after stealing a tiara, found the tower Rapunzel was locked up in, she smacked him on the head with a frying pan, and the rest is history. The two didn't realize they had feelings for each other until about halfway into the movie, but we're so glad they did. But it might shock you when you learn that they have the biggest age gap out of all Disney couples. Rapunzel's 18, while Flynn Rider is in his mid-twenties. Regardless of their age difference, their love story inspired many other couples, including these two, who are Disneyland's official Rapunzel and Flynn Rider. Their outfits have so much detail, it's actually very impressive. What else you'd expect from an actual real-life Disney couple? Rapunzel's hair looks absolutely stunning, while Flynn's haircut is styled in the same way as the actual animated version. The two seem to have the same chemistry as our beloved Tangled couple, and we love it. Speaking of Rapunzel's hair, did you know that it took about six to seven years to fully develop her hair in the movie? They didn't know how it was going to come out until the very last minute. But it's safe to say those seven years of production have really paid off. Tarzan and Jane but let's move away from the typical Disney princesses and their beloved princes and have a look at some slightly unusual pairings we were able to enjoy. Does I Tarzan, you Jane sound familiar? We haven't talked much about this Disney movie on this channel so far, but it's definitely worthy of a mention. After all, it is one of the must-see classics. Disney released Tarzan the movie in 1999. The two met when Jane got separated from her team of human explorers after they were chased by baboons. Tarzan saved her, and after realizing he was human just like she was, the two fell in love. In 2002, Disney followed up on their love with a sequel called Tarzan and Jane. Their names and Tarzan's famous catchphrase became everyone's favorite pickup line, and it looks like it really worked for some couples. These two real-life examples of the unusual pair come straight out of Disneyland, and they look absolutely amazing. Jane's outfit is spot on, and Tarzan is rocking those dreadlocks. The looks of Tarzan and Jane haven't changed, even after the classic was remade into an actual movie in 2016. Tarzan is played by Alexander Skarsgård, who joked that the directors didn't have to do much to his looks to turn him into his iconic character. We have to give him credit, because not a lot of people can pull off the Tarzan scream. Woody and Bo Peep 
Another unusual pairing we absolutely have to mention is Woody and Bo Peep. The two really hit it off when Andy paired them together. Woody had to save Bo Peep, and the two later became an actual couple. Isn't that the cutest thing ever? This couple decided to recreate their love, and they did a fantastic job. The images belong to a DeviantArt user, Ilion Cosplay. We're always impressed with the way cosplayers can make and use props to recreate their favorite Disney characters. The attention to detail is often amazing, and we love how these two recreated the two Toy Story characters in the best way possible. Love is definitely in the air. Here's some good news for all you Toy Story fans. The director of the movie confirmed that Toy Story 4 will focus on Woody and Bo Peep's romance. Disney follows an interesting rule when it comes to sequels. They don't make another movie unless they come up with a storyline that's just as good or even better. It's safe to say that we're in for a roller coaster story if it's going to focus on these two lovebirds. The news about the feature started a few years ago, and you'll finally be able to catch Toy Story 4 in cinemas in 2019. Cinderella and Prince Charming. And who could forget about the ultimate relationship goals couple? Every little girl dreams of meeting her very own version of Prince Charming. And we all have Cinderella to thank for that name. The story of Cinderella completely enchanted the world and we all cheered on Prince Charming as he went on a quest to find the owner of the glass slipper. And the two lived happily ever after. The true, real-life Cinderella and Prince Charming are, of course, the performers you can catch at Disneyland. They really do bring you a cinematic Cinderella experience. And they're just so cute! Just like Tarzan and Jane, Cinderella and Prince Charming also got their very own movie remake in 2015. You can now catch a human version of the pair, played by Lily James and Richard Madden, who portrayed an excellent version of Prince Charming. Speaking of Prince Charming, do you know his actual name? Don't worry if you don't, because neither do we. Although there are many fan theories and rumors floating around, Prince Charming's name is still unknown. Along with the Beast and the prince from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, he's the only Disney prince without an official name. Come on, Disney, doesn't he deserve to have a name after all this time? Pocahontas and John Smith out of all the love stories we're showing you today, this one is actually based on a true story. Unfortunately, it was much sadder than the one we saw in our favorite movie. Pocahontas was only a child when she met John Smith, and the Europeans did terrible things to her before she married another John, John Rolfe. So this time, we think that the cartoon version of this man is actually the best. But that didn't keep people from rewriting this story and turning John into a man who actually deserves the chance to meet the Native American woman. The images you're about to see belong to a brilliant DeviantArt cosplayer, Chingrish. He recreated a pretty impressive version of John Smith, and his friend could definitely play the part of Pocahontas. Kudos for getting John Smith's hair to stay in the right shape. We can't imagine how much hairspray he had to use to reach this style. Do you want to hear something cool? Irene Bedard, the actress that voiced Pocahontas, was also used as a live-action model. Irene said that her two-year-old easily recognizes her movements in Pocahontas when they're watching the movie. Irene also confirmed why Pocahontas is one of the strongest Disney princesses. She doesn't wait for her prince and doesn't need him to tell the story. In fact, Pocahontas is the one that saved John Smith in the first place. We definitely love her independent attitude. Beauty and the Beast If you ever want to catch Beauty and the Beast in real life, you absolutely have to visit Disneyland. You might just spot them randomly walking down the street like it's no big deal. Beauty and the Beast is a story of true love and a life lesson that the beauty really lies on the inside. Belle could have gone with the strong and mighty, but also terribly arrogant Gaston. But her heart was set on the Beast. Beauty and the Beast was released in 1991, but Walt Disney actually had the idea for the story in the 1930s and wanted to create it in the 1950s. But the story was too difficult to bring to life at that time. Did you know that the song Human Again was only added in the 2002 re-release, but was originally cut from the movie right before the production? It's one of our favorite songs from the film. 
the iconic classic had several live-action movies, including a 1946 edition, which was an inspiration for Disney's version. You've probably heard of the 2017 remake of the movie, right? You don't have to go to Disneyland to see the two characters as humans. Emma Watson and Dan Stevens probably play the best real-life versions of Beauty and the Beast, and they're incredible to watch. Tiana and Prince Naveen the story of these two is quite an interesting one. They were both frogs at some point, and you'd think Tiana would never fall for someone who turned her into a frog, but true love really shows no boundaries. We're actually impressed that Tiana's hard work and life values finally rubbed off on Prince Naveen at the end of the story. We'd love to see what the two are doing now. You can actually find the real-life Princess Tiana and Prince Naveen at Disneyland, and they are just as cute as the actual animated version. We love Prince Naveen's smile. Tiana's story received a lot of praise, as she's not your regular princess. Besides Pocahontas, she's probably one of the most independent and hardworking characters on our list. She knows what she wants, but she also knows she has to work hard to get it. Not many princesses dream of owning a restaurant, but that's precisely why Tiana is so unique. The directors of the movie describe Tiana as someone who's warm and vulnerable, but with a lot of backbone. She doesn't give in to things very easily, and it took a while before she warmed up to her version of Prince Charming. Snow White and the Prince Speaking of nameless princes, we'll probably never find out the name of the prince in Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Someday my prince will come are 14-year-old Snow White's lyrics as she's singing to the Seven Dwarfs. And her prince really did come, and much like everyone else, they lived happily ever after. And yes, Snow White was just 14 when she met her almost 18-year-old prince. But let's ignore that fact and show you some real-life, of-age examples of these two classic lovebirds. If you want to find a live version of Snow White and the Prince, you'll have to visit Disneyland where you'll get absolutely enchanted because the two really do look like the real deal. Did you know that Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is the first animated Disney movie ever? It's the one that started it all and made us fall in love with Disney couples. Producing this movie was a huge gamble for Walt Disney as he had no idea how it'll be perceived by the public. We're so happy Disney followed his dreams and created the movies we know and love today. And we bet at least one of you got the Someday My Prince Will Come song stuck in your head. Jasmine and Aladdin. And last but not least, it's the two that brought us a whole new world of adventures on a magic carpet. Jasmine and Aladdin are one of the most popular Disney couples out there, and we can certainly see why. The two share quite a powerful chemistry. Combined with Jasmine's sassiness and Aladdin's mischievous character, the two are a perfect match. It looks like that Jasmine and Aladdin from Disneyland are just as happily in love as the film version of the two lovebirds. Speaking of Aladdin, did you know that Tom Cruise was a huge inspiration behind his character? And did you know that the animator behind the movie had no idea how to draw Jasmine until he noticed his sister had a particularly interesting hairstyle in a high school photo? Disney animators really pull off inspiration from just about anywhere, and we can't wait to see what they'll come up with next. What we'd really love to see is a real-life Jasmine and Aladdin flying on an actual magic carpet instead of their floating boat during the Disneyland parade. We just can't get over how cute they look, and we hope real love sparks are flying between these two. If there's one thing we learned today is that all you need is love and a bit of cosplay, and you'll be able to become a real-life Disney couple. Which Disney couple is your favorite? Let us know in the comments. For more Disney mania, check out 10 Disney princesses reimagined as monsters. See you next time.